Hi there, wedding enthusiasts. Welcome to Wedding News, where love takes the center stage and emotions run wild. I'm your host, Fiona Davis, and as usual, we'll cover tales of love, romance, makeup, breakups, and everything in between. So fasten your seatbelts as we go through this whirlwind of fashion, heartache, and the unexpected. On the news today, media personality Wafa Ewa gets married to her beau, Taiwo Cole, while his family openly disassociates themselves from the union. Ghanaian singer Gladstone Akwaba Jr. ties the knot. Jeannie and Jeezy's divorce saga continues to unfold with new revelations coming to light. Stick around for all the scoop. Welcome back. Angel, former Big Brother Niger housemate, melt hearts with a touching Instagram post dedicated to her partner, Soma, on his birthday. The couple who met during the BB Niger 2023 All-Stars edition shares a special bond that transcends reality TV. In her legendary birthday message, Angel expresses admiration for Soma's warmth and determination, liking him to the warmth of the sun in winter. She wrote, Apricity, the warmth of the sun in the winter. That's how I would describe you and that's what you are to me. Warmth but not only to me, to everyone around you. You have a way of warming up even the coldest of rooms. It could be with that boisterous laughter so full that you ask to be noticed. Not in a way that is attention seeking, but in a way that announces that someone beautiful is in the room. And I'm sure anyone who has heard your laugh has seen the gleam in your eyes that comes immediately after. I'm jealous of them. Jealous that they get to experience you. I can't imagine how 32 years have been. I've never lived it, neither do I know but I guess it was determination that got you here. You're so determined. I see it every time you repeat a task over and over again until you get it right. Or when you bounce your legs repeatedly, when you're getting frustrated, but still want to meet up a goal. I also see the determination when you smile, when you have that deep smile line just by the side of your cheek. Maybe I thought about it too deeply, but in my mind, it's probably there because of all the times you had to smile even when you didn't feel like it. All the times you had to mask because even if it made no sense, you were determined to make it make sense. I will tell you how many birthmarks on your body I have counted secretly but I will sound creepy and I know you say I never notice anything but I do how else would I have written this happy birthday note happy birthday Somadina truly you shall never walk alone you'll walk with happiness prosperity abundance health wealth love and hopefully me and if not for the rest of our lives I couldn't imagine a better person to have fallen in love with to know you is to love you to know you is to cherish you and you deserve the very best life has to offer 32 shall be nothing short of what you imagined. It will be even so much more than you ever did. Here's to another year around the sun. Although I don't know how you make it that the earth travels around you whilst you're still here with us. Love you so very much. You already know what I'm going to say. Have a ball, angel. As they celebrate Soma's 32nd birthday, their enduring love and unwavering commitment to each other is quite evident. With Angel by his side, Soma embarks on another journey around the sun, surrounded by love and cherished memories. Happy birthday, Soma. Popular Nigerian actress and comedian Wafai Father recently tied the knot with her partner Taiwo Olaki Tonko in a traditional wedding ceremony that captivated fans worldwide. However, amidst the joyous occasion, a family dispute emerged as the Cole family from Victoria Island, Lagos publicly disassociated themselves from the union. The wedding held in Ugeb, Cross River State, garnered attention on social media with photos and videos flooding timelines, eliciting an outpouring of love and well wishes. Yet, the family patriarch Kunle Ko released a statement denouncing the marriage, asserting the family's non-consent. The letter reads, Images and videos have come to our attention showing our son, Taiwo, getting married to Wafai Ewa in a traditional ceremony in Ugep, Cross River State. This serves to notify all acquaintances, family and friends that the Ko family of Victoria Island, Lagos are not aware of any marriage ceremony of our son, Taiwo Olagiton Ko. Neither do we grant permission nor support in this regard. As such, persons parading themselves as new members of the Ko heritage by virtue of this purported event are not known or accepted by the family. All publications and documents being circulated about this are to be disregarded, Engineer Kunle Cole for the family. Despite the family rifts, Wafai and Tai will continue to share moments from the ceremony on social media, seemingly unperturbed by the family rejection. In a surprising turn, Taiwo's twin Kenye Cole took to social media to congratulate the newlyweds amidst the family dispute. As the saga continues to unfold, questions linger about the authenticity of the union and the implications of family born captivating the attention of fans and well-wishers alike. 
Portable fame for his dramatic episodes and his wife, Bewaji Ewatomi, seems to have set aside their recent social media squabbles as they embark on a trip to Nairobi, Kenya, where Portable is scheduled to perform. The couple's reconciliation comes in the wake of Portable's public airing of grievances against his wife, sparking widespread reactions online. In a series of videos posted by Portable, the couple appeared jovial and excited as they documented their journey aboard the plane to Kenya. The footage suggests that they've moved past their recent dispute and are focused on enjoying their time together. Their sudden reconciliation has left online spectators reflecting on the adage, this really is why one shouldn't get involved in couples' issues, underscoring the unpredictability of relationships and the power of forgiveness. Well, stay put, wedding news will be right back. Welcome back. Ghanaian singer and songwriter Glasnama Kwabwa Jr. is basking in the joy of marital bliss as he celebrates his union with his beloved in a traditional wedding ceremony. The exclusive video footage and pictures shared online provide a glimpse into the joyous occasion, capturing the essence of love, culture and celebration. Theresa, the wife of Akwaba Jr., made a stunning appearance at their traditional Ghanaian wedding, adorning herself in a star-studded corseted kente gown. The vibrant colors of red, blue and yellow beads hand beaded into the gown, carefully created a beautiful pattern, reflecting the rich cultural heritage of Ghana. Set against the backdrop of vibrant Ghanaian traditions and customs, the video showcases the colorful festivities as the family members, friends and well-wishers came together to honor the union of Akwaba and his beloved partner, Theresa. As they embark on this new chapter of their lives together, the couple continues to inspire admiration with images of their blissful union already garnering widespread attention. With love, happiness and music as their guiding forces, Akwaba and Teresa are poised to create lasting memories and a future filled with joy. Well, congratulations to the happy couple. Ghanaian actor Kaliwos, who recently tied the knot, is reveling in the joys of married life, expressing his newfound happiness and fulfillment. In an interview, he confessed that marriage has exceeded his expectations, admitting he wishes he had taken the plunge sooner. Speaking glowingly about his marriage, Kalibo shared how waking up to someone who cares deeply for him has been a source of immense joy. He humorously lamented not realizing the sweetness of marriage earlier, jokingly suggesting that he would have tied a knot three years ago if he had known. During the interview, Kalibos revealed a surprise element of his wedding ceremony, having his longtime screen partner, Ahofe Patri, serve as his best man. This unexpected choice surprised his groomsmen, who had prepared speeches, assuming one of them would fill the role. Instead, Ahofe Patri stepped in, adding a memorable twist to the celebration. However, Patri faced backlash from some social media users for her role, with speculation swirling about the nature of her relationship with Kalibos. Well, despite the criticism, both actors share fond memories of their special day, emphasizing the joy and camaraderie that marked the occasion. Samuel Ndunda Nzuki, a 67-year-old man who gained attention due to his relationship with Kenyan socialite Manzi Wakibera, was laid to rest at Langata Cemetery. His passing came after his illness, which started in April 18, 2024, and he eventually succumbed to his illness on April 21st, leaving Manzi Wakibera devastated. The funeral was a private affair attended only by close family members and a select few relatives. The discreet ceremony respected the wishes of Nzuki's family for a dignified send-off away from the public eye. Surprisingly, despite their past relationship, Mazi Wakibera was not at the funeral. Her manager, Charlie Wakibera, provided an update on the situation via Instagram, revealing that neither he nor Mazi Wakibera received an invitation to the burial. The family's decision to keep the event private meant that even close associates like Charlie and Manzi Wakibera were not included in the ceremony. In an Instagram video, Charlie Wakibera clarified the reason behind their absence, emphasizing that the family aimed to avoid social media attention during the proceedings. Charlie expressed understanding, acknowledging the family's concerns that their presence might attract press coverage, which they wished to avoid. He assured followers that they would find their own time to pay respect at Suzuki's grave privately, respecting the family's wishes for a quiet and respectful farewell. We hope Manzi Wakibera is able to bear the loss and eventually find happiness again. And on the international scene, the divorce saga between Jinny Maya and Jeezy continues to unfold. In recent court documents, Jeezy alleged that his estranged wife, Jinny Maya, desires to have a second child with him, even contacting their doctor about pursuing IVF after he disclosed plans to file divorce. Now, the documents claim that they attempted to conceive naturally for over a year before this revelation. Despite Jeannie's previous accusations of domestic abuse and child neglect against Jeezy, he denied these claims and questioned why she would want to have a second child with him if he was as violent and irresponsible as she claimed. 
The couple who share a two-year-old daughter named Monaco have been engaged in a legal battle over their prenuptial agreement and custody rights since Jeezy filed for divorce in September 2023. Jeezy is currently seeking joint physical and legal custody of Monaco. And in response to Jeannie's allegations, Jeezy called them false and disturbing, emphasizing his commitment to being an active father to their daughter. He expressed confidence that the truth will prevail through the legal process. And that brings us to the end of Wedding News today. Don't forget to follow us on all social media platforms at Wedding Channel and on YouTube, Wedding Channel Africa. I'm Fiona Davis. Until next time, stay tuned, stay jiggy.